right, so that's it. Well, that's not it. That's it for night number two. Still got one more big one tomorrow. Good set openers and closers tonight. Sam getting us started. Jen ending it. Set your soul free, opening up the second set. Slave ending the second set, you know, and then some jams in between. Some miniature jams tonight, you know, Down With Disease, Twist, Piper. Felt like all of those, I was hoping, you know, right when they got to that point, it was like, all right, here we go. Let's strap in and then, yeah, on to the next song. Set your soul free, probably the winner of the night. Not just because it ran, you know, the duration was the longest. Probably clocked in somewhere in that 15 to 20 minute range. Not all the jams need to be 20 minutes, but, you know, sometimes it's nice when they are. Down with disease after the opening sand, you know, you know that's a pretty good way to get You know, if you hadn't worked up a sweat, you certainly had after the sand down with disease opener. Had a noob sit in for part of the first set tonight. They only made it till Wombat, which is not bad, actually. You know, I even tried to explain to them my Wombat catapult theory. They didn't seem too interested. But so anyhow, just like they bailed on the down with disease jam, the noob bailed on me for Wombat. It's all right, though. Then we got the shade. After the down with disease, calming you down from the 20 minute plus jam, the dance party where the start to the show, then home, Paige McConnell taking over, Wolfman's brother. Look, any first set that's got sand, Wolfman's, and gin, you know I'm giving it a big thumbs up. That's the case tonight. The Wolfman's jam, you know, pretty standard for first set. Then Wombat, you know, you know that was at this point the new pointed out Trey seems to be the happiest. Question whether or not Paige's fingers ever get sore course questioning Fishman's dress and then just questioning everything about Mike Gordon from the hair to the shoes and everything in between and I got a little bit of a bone to pick with Mike Gordon this is going back a ways now but I never brought it up I should have the night he dropped his pants took his pants off had a pair of shorts underneath he like folded them up nicely and put them back I feel like you know you got if you're gonna pull that move you're gonna take your pants off mid set that's fine but you gotta throw that shit in the crowd right I think everybody agrees with me on that one I don't know how much those pants cost, but whatever, Mike. You can get another pair. This is rock and roll, dude. You got to throw that shit in the crowd. Felt like tonight for the encore, he might have even come out with a new pair of shoes. You know, I don't suggest winging a couple of shoes into the crowd, but maybe you could lightly toss them there to the front. Something like that. All right, so where were we? Everything's right after Wombat. That song's really, you know, I want to say it's grown on me. I kind of liked it from the get-go, and then the bathtub gin ending the first set strong. Just like we started with Sand. Then on to the second set, Set Your Soul Free, like I said, perhaps the jam of the night. Fago and Chalk Dust following that up. Nice little jams, but nothing that ran too long. Then Twist and Piper, same thing. As soon as the jams are about to start, jams are ending. On to Wedge, 2001, playing around with it a little bit. Then Sneaking Sally through the alley. Feel like that's a bust out every time they play it. But, you know, I guess it's the token once or twice a year. We get it tonight. Last one, I guess, must have been last year's Baker Dozen. Baker's Dozen, Sal, eh, maybe the New Year's run, I don't know, eh, somewhere in there. And then Slave to the Traffic Light, ending the second set. Kind of wish they would have saved that to end the second set tomorrow, but all right, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get greedy. We still got one more night, then the more encore ending it. Mike's Shoes, like I mentioned, I know what was going on. That was actually, it was actually a two-song encore. Mike's Shoes, the webcam followed him, the webcast was following him out on stage. What's going on with those lights? Where do you, where, where can I get me a pair of those? Maybe you can get them from you can get them from Mike Gordon himself. All right, guys. I don't know. I'm just rambling on at this point. Another good show. We got one night to go. You know, maybe expectations. I might have got my expectations a little bit high after last night. Just thought, man, this is just going to be three nights of pure fury. You know, not that tonight was bad, but last night was you know major heater last night. And then tonight, getting teased a little bit in the jams. That's all. All right, guys. Boom. We're out of here. We got one more night. And then that'll be the last boom until fall tour.